All right, everyone. Welcome back to Founders Fortune. Hold on. I actually have to look to make sure that's what the game's actually called still. Yeah, Founders Fortune. All right. I almost forgot. Surprise. Um, yeah, welcome back to our little house. You totally didn't see the two de dead guys right outside. Nope, nope, nope. No dead guys here. Uh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, so there we have our little hut. We're going to expand on our hut today. We're maxed out on resources. Our villagers are just lazing around, which is not a bad thing necessarily. Mm -hmm. um, everyone just wants to tell jokes and yep. get their desires <laughs> met or something. Somehow he wants to be a farmer in the winter. I don't know how that's going to happen. Yeah. And level seven is a miner. Like, dang, you go, girl. Get your ambitions or whatever. Actually, hold on. Do I have enough? Take ownership. Yeah, that should work. Boom. That's an easy yep. an easy accomplishment there. Uh, great friend with Hemi. Okay. I know his name's not really Hemi, but I can't say it, so I'm going to say Hemi. All right. Um, right. So, Anna, where did you run off to? Do you want to impress him with your feminine willies? Not that the, the game really shows any. Well, he uh, wasn't put off by it, I don't think. He just wants a, a stool, apparently. Mm -hmm. Go sit back down. All right, I guess while these guys are just going through their little winter month, I will speed it up just to try to get us through winter. And uh, we will craft ourselves a uh, an upgraded house here. So I, I was going to do this earlier, but then, you know, kind of ran out of... Uh, Coins. What the? Kind of ran out of wood earlier. So we're gonna do with this now. I think I have enough wood. We can do it just fine. Uh, right. Okay. So the staircase will go there. Then we're going to. I think what I'll do is I'll just cover the whole existing floor plan with material, like so. And that shouldn't do all that bad for us, actually. Apparently you can't just drag everywhere, you have to uh, do this. Alright, there you go. All of our walls are done. Good, good, good. Um, now that I think about it though, I might put a pause in here real quick. It's the last day of winter. Yay! Um. Do I want this to be this way? Eh, that's probably all right. Do that. Yeah, sure, that's fine. Because our rooms are only three by threes, right? Oh no, that's two. Oh, no, nope, that's wrong. Okay. Okay, so we need to pop this room out to there, like that, and then this is three wide, so we could put a couple rooms there probably, or do we want to just have big rooms for people, like put two people in a room, just have a one big massive room for them, that might be alright, that might, that might be alright. Um, and then this room here will be a smaller room, I guess. Like that. So whoever gets this room gets a midget room. But the other rooms will be a lot bigger and I can put dressers and shelves and all sorts of shit in there. Or do I not do this and do like more of like a, like a lounging area maybe? That might be right. Then I can clear out some of these other rooms on the bottom floor and do other stuff. That would probably be decent. So that's not too bad. Okay, we'll do that. Let's do some doors here. Or, you know, by one option of door. I will throw the door there and there. I think that's probably all right. And then... Should do some windows. 
People like to look outside once in a while. That way you can't see into the other person's room, that's fine. And then... Do we want to get all decora decoration-y? Put some potted plants or something. Window box? Yeah, let's do some window boxes. Let's do like that and that. And then maybe like red ones on this side. Ooh, can I do shutters as well? Oh, I can. Oh, I don't have any more wood though. Never mind. Wow. We just burnt through 300 wood. <laughs> Holy crap. That's a lot of wood burnt through. Okay, well. Yeah, that would get us at least a base, base plan going for, for, for that. Now let's go back down to the main floor here. So I want to expand on our workshop room. Uh, I do need more wood right now, but... Uh, I could, I guess, expand the floor? Actually, what do I have for walls? I do have stone walls. Maybe we'll expand with stone. I'll go that route. Maybe this will be like the cooking side, because it's all stone. It won't burn down or anything. Yeah, should probably be all right. So I'll do that, and then I don't have any wood for anything else. So I guess we'll live with that. Oh right, uh, walls. Let's take this wall back down. This wall. This won't go away. Gives me two wood back. Doors. Windows? Enough for one window. Right there. Cool. Okay, that will do. Uh, that will expand this room out massively. I can then move our fireplace furnace thing there. Or no, actually let's put it let's put it over here. Let's put it in this corner. Mm -hmm. Let's pull this over here. It gives us just more space in this corner. The textile loom. Can I not? So that gets moved, that gets moved. This is our storage. Can't do that, okay. What if I rotate this? I gotta wait till that's moved, really? <sighs> I suppose let's move this over here in this corner. It's not necessarily food, but it kind of is. Like, it's foody, eating. Then I could put the loom over here, and then with a textile. I don't know. We'll figure it out. But yeah, I think that should be big enough. Okay, yeah, 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 let's do that. Go, go wild, my minions. My peoples. Something. I'll have to come up with names. It's not really something I'm good at. Ah. Yes, mine that rock. Because we totally need more. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, great friends with Hemi. Uh, how is this relationship? Oh yeah, they're not even, not even great friends yet. Yep. Got Nicole, yep. who started out after Anna, is better friends with Hemi than Anna is. It's kind of sad. Actually, Nicole, uh, you know, I can afford that. That's not gold, so that's that's fine. I'll improve that relationship with the natives just because anything that's not gold we can basically afford at this point. Oh, sure, a blizzard on the last day of the year. Wonderful. Hey, there's a snowman. I didn't tell anyone to make a snowman. I wonder if he'll melt tomorrow. Yeah, you kick that rock. <laughs> oh, jeez. I 
Let's go upstairs and see what the upstairs looks like. Alright, it's going along. Yeah, cool. I guess that feels a little weird, having planter boxes right next to a roof, but... Eh, oh well. I would have put, like, a shed roof on this that just slants instead of something like this. But, again, that's not really an option that we get in the game, because we don't get to make the roof. We just gotta live with it. But, uh, but yeah, I think that's gonna be a decent start to, you know, a couple of new rooms. I have a lot more wood now. Good. Uh, we will go with comfortable beds, then. We'll put them right next to each other. You know, because I'm sure... Oh, wait, hold on. We need more guys in our colony, because... I like to pair people up into rooms, but it's like, wait, I have three girls and one guy. Uh, hmm. Well, we'll give the original two beds. Because they're the original two, they've been around the longest. They'll get priority on the beds. And uh, it is spring of the year two, so uh, not too bad. Looks like we have some more foods. We didn't run out of food over the winter. That's good. We made it to so year two somehow, and uh, we did all right. Um, it, you know, the house is is two story. We got four residents. They're becoming more happy as as we go. I uh, need to get somebody writing discovered. It looks like research is done. I should probably do watering, actually. Let's research that next. Writing after that, just because I need the well in the, in the watering can for farming. Uh, that would be super helpful, I'm sure. Uh, Hannah Lore wants to tell a joke to the member of the trading guild and discover weaponry. Again, um, I really would rather get watering than weaponry done. So, hmm. Yeah. Ooh, actually, now that I think about that, I could put the research storage upstairs. That'd be kind of cool. Level 3 Forester. Good job, uh, Hannah Lore. Armor stand, clothes stand. Armor stand. Yeah, we'll throw armor stands up here. One. Ooh, actually, no. Who wanted the armor stand again? Mm -hmm. Nicole did? Okay, Nicole, you're going to get an armor stand in your new room. Oh, no, not the buggies. Uh, yep. Hemi, whatever you get. It. Oh, God, there's bugs everywhere. No. Why? Why does all of our tomatoes have bugs on them? <sighs> Dang it. Okay. Um, yep. Nicole, one of the armor stand. So, Nicole. Storage. Armor stand. Her new room will have it. Uh, I'm assuming it goes this way. I don't know. Oh, yeah, I suppose. How would I go up a room? I never thought about that. Can you not move a bit out from under somebody? Apparently not. Okay. Good to know. I guess I'll move these two beds out just because no one is assigned to them right now. And then can I go up a floor and drag them over? It appears I can. Kind of a weird way to have to do that. But. Yeah, it appears like that is the way to do it. Okay, so that will just move those two over there. And then I'll sign them upstairs at that point. Because mm -hmm. Nicole needs it. Oh, just, Nicole just needs it in her possession. Okay, cool. Boom, done. Taylor workshop in the colony. Okay, well. Now that yeah. multiple people need that, we might as well do that one. Uh, ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee -ba -dee. that is work. Wait, what are we missing? 40 cloth. Of course we're missing 40 cloth. What do I need? 
Oof, I only have six. Ouch. Okay, well, we'll have to go down to the workshop. We'll have to get on the loom. And we'll have to queue up. Good ol'. How much do we have? Oh, we do not have enough cotton, even. Uh, we'll just queue up, like, 34. And then we'll hope these guys go and pick their cotton by themselves. Where's the cotton even at? There it is. Yeah, cotton's fully grown, so we have it. Just a matter of getting someone to go do it. Um, what do we have access to here? No watering can, not that. Okay, cool. I haven't seen any sheep in either of the games I've played yet, either. Like, pigs and cows on this map, but I don't see any sheep. Uh, crystal and stone? Yeah. That's fine. It's not gold. Again, that's like my, my main concern. Like, if you don't take my gold, I'll give you the other resources. Because <laughs> the other ones are, like, not infinite, but they're pretty, pretty common. So. Yep. Yeah. What are you doing? Are you taking a break? Clothes storage. Anna needs clothes storage. Okay. Boom. Clothes storage it is. Yep. Yeah. Need the yeah. loom. Need the yep. loom. Need to tell jokes. And make weapons. Okay. So... Not too bad. Spring is here, so we got potatoes going. I almost wonder if I should expand this and just grow massive amounts of potatoes. And we could. Okay, yeah. Did you build your own? You did. Good job. Uh, she needs a chest in her room. That's easy enough. Wooden chest. Good enough for me. That was an, uh, another easy wish. Man, her mood's gonna just skyrocket here. It's awesome. She'll be really happy. He really just needs that tailor's workshop. Which I don't have the cotton for yet. So does she. Yep. And she probably just needs to talk to somebody. Let's go talk to Nicole, wherever Nicole's at. Nicole's way over here. Punching apple trees. Talk about food. Be friends. Be happy. Man, you guys are really far away. Good thing the moon natives like us. I am curious about their cauldron, though. If I... Do that. Destroy. Nope. Destroy. Destroy. Talk risky joke. Oh gosh. Insult. Let's not insult the natives. That would be probably not good. I wonder if you can befriend them like... Hmm. Don't know. And you guys... Ah, great friend. Wow. Nice. Good job, girls. Just gotta get okay. that, uh... That really didn't improve her mood all that much, though. Uh, you know what? I might just say no telling jokes. Oh, uh, well, that's a lot easier to do. Okay. Um, Hannah, whatever. I'm gonna throw you there. Nicole, we're gonna throw you there. Uh, yep. Hannah Lore just wants a clothes stand. So we will get some more storage going. And I can't see over your thought bubbles. Why did your thought bubbles go through the floor? There it is. Okay. That should be a nice clothing stand for you. Yep. Man, wish denied. Hungry, aggressive. Oof. What is this aggressive goblin relationship yep. thing? Yep. Ah, Hemi finally got his... 
He has insomnia. Oh, if he has insomnia, he can't get the other good... Oh, he can't get the other good sleeping one. No. Oh, I can remove it for two points, though. Yep, getting rid of that. Did I actually get rid of it? It did. Sweet. And he can learn tireless now. Sweet. So we can get him level up again, we can get that tireless going, and then he'll be an even better person. Cool. Okay, uh, yes, yeah, so we're getting somewhere. We just need, it looks like, that workshop, and then I think we'll be doing a rocket. Right. And what tree? Oh no, she's moody. Ah, what to do? She needs better food. Are you serious? Raw food's not going to cut it no more. All right, Emmy, get your farming skill up, please. It's, I need you to be a better farmer so we can have cooking. <sighs> what is everyone doing downstairs? Just chillaxing or what? No, oh, he's researching again. Right. Good for him. What, okay, what is Anna's tasks? Like, we don't have enough stone. Why aren't you out mining stone? Are we out of... Oh, we're out of stone piles. That's why. Okay. Mine some more stone. There it is. Boom. Low spirits. So, if her mood hits zero, she'll go rogue, basically. <laughs> I'm hoping that doesn't happen. Because she won't take any orders from me for a set period of time in the game. So, hopefully we can avoid that, but we'll see. Have we not given her satisfaction level 1 yet? Really? Oh. Oopsie. Oh, she has her food. That's good. Alright, um, just waiting on that bloody cotton. Oh, we have enough cotton now. Okay. So, Hemi, you go make, no, um, make a, da, make a da weave. Oh, you should probably put your dream catch upstairs as well. Hemi had a bad dream. Yeah, Hemi had a bad dream, so I'll put the dream catch upstairs. So I guess I'll drag it out. Okay, that works. And we'll just pop it right there. I think it sticks to the ceiling, so it's just gonna do back and happen. Cool. Um, what do we have for rug unlocks? Nothing. We need decoration for that. Um, lazy day. Life hasn't been the greatest for Hannah Laura. Today she's taking it easy. Oh no. All right. Well, this is this is what happens when their mood goes to shit. Basically, uh, for nine minutes of the game, they uh, don't do anything you say. So they'll do no tasks. They will just do whatever the fuck they want. And uh, yeah, so I tried to get someone to build the damn clothing rack, but no one did. What? I mean, why did you just have a bad man? Bad dream times two. Someone needs to move that dream catcher. And you need to get your stupid farming skill up. Come on! I need that farming skill. Well, rested four, though. But that's good. Alrighty. Well, after he gets the loom going. Uh, what is that machine called again? Oh, we got a trader. Okay. Who's not busy? Yep. Nicole, you're a little moody, but not really busy. You go meet the trader, who is inside the beacon, it looks like. Uh, trade. I'm gonna make you run over there, because I don't want to wait the entire time. Man, you're getting old, though. 
All right. Um, we can sell him a bunch of stuff for... Oh, there's piggies. I think we have access to pigs, though. Simple bow. Stonox scroll healing potions. 175. Ouch. Stone. I can buy stone. Eh, yucky. Honestly, I don't really need anything from the guy. I thought maybe it would be nice. Well, maybe this wouldn't be so bad. I might pass on it, though. He will sell me... That's not a bad deal. 50 gold for iron. And I'm not even using iron yet. That's fair. Wood, I'll give him 100. Get me back up to 80. Um, I guess I don't have enough storage. Oh yeah, I do. Cool. That'll work. Low spirits. I know you have low spirits. I'll make your satisfaction rise eventually. One skill point. Uh, where do we want to put this? Metal tools? Planting pine trees is actually more useful. So we're going to hold off on that, I suppose. <sighs> Alrighty. Anna's banging her rocks. Hemi is chatting, nope, storing with Han Hanalore, which is good. Hopefully improving her mood. And she's very moody right now. Also, she's actually kind of young. Yeah. But I think they're about as young as each other. That's good. So we got two old ladies and two young birds. Maybe we should stick them two in a room together. Hmm. Anna hurt her leg. Oh no. The trainer's leaving. Good for them. Man, research. Alright, I think I'm going to wrap it up here, guys. Uh, this has kind of been the first year of the game. Uh, if you like the series so far, let me know. And I'll try to continue it. Uh, but if you didn't like it, that's fine. We'll just call it quits at this point. I might still play along myself uh, just a bit, just kind of play through it. Because uh, again, I I do enjoy these style of games that you kind of have to manage a colony and do stuff. Um, but yeah, if you guys liked it, we'll, we'll we can continue the series. If you don't, uh, just let me know in the comments, and uh, yeah, we'll do something else instead. So, God. everyone has low spirits. Is everyone just moody or what? Jeez. Alright, uh, well, yeah, we'll see you guys later. Have a good day, have a good night, have a good afternoon. Bye-bye.